Okay, so the workout's done, and now it's time to cool down. So in the cool down phase, we are going to do some static stretching uh, just to wind the body down. Uh, we probably have been working out with weights, so uh, had a lot of joint movements, a lot of things going on. So let's go ahead and do a static stretch to uh, cool down. Now, the way that I have this structured is I have three exercises we're going to do for each side. Uh, I've got the timer set at 30 seconds. Uh, you guys can obviously go through more than once. You don't just have to do this once. Uh, but for the timing of this video, this whole uh, ending stretch is about six minutes long. Uh, so if you guys want a second round, you're more than welcome, or you can adjust the time. So we're gonna go ahead and start with half kneeling. So we gotta do both sides, okay? I'm gonna go ahead and start with a half kneeling twist. So one knee's down, the other leg's up. We're gonna hold this for 30 seconds and we're gonna rotate, okay? So I'm facing this way. Kinda of can use this hand, I can pull a little bit on that leg just to send me a little farther into that stretch. Sit up nice and tall and breathe. Okay, we're gonna stay on this side. We're gonna go into a half kneeling triangle. Okay, so what we're gonna do is take that arm, we're gonna put it down on the ground, we're gonna take the other arm, and we're gonna rotate it up. We're gonna look at that top hand. Keep breathing. Okay, we should be about done. So now we're gonna take this top arm and we're gonna rotate it down, just like we're trying to put that elbow into the floor. It's gonna cause us to sink a little farther into that leg. So I should feel the nice stretch right there on that inner thigh and that uh, adductor that's there. Okay, you don't wanna let that leg open up okay we're fighting that stretch so keep it pulled in all right all right good job switch sides on up push the rotation just keep breathing so more than likely, your heart rate's still pretty elevated because you just got through exercising, so just try to focus on your breathing. Let's get it back down. Okay, the triangle pose, definitely a little more challenging, so half kneeling. Put that hand down, rotate that other arm up. So if you've got a tight chest, okay, you'll notice that this is about as far as you can go, all right? But we wanna fight that because we're stretching. So pull that arm back, all right? So immobility in the shoulder can also cause you to not pull up or you'll be here or you'll be back here, okay? We wanna try to be as straight as possible. Again, try to not let that knee come out, okay? So now let's rotate it down, push into the ground. Okay, I can just feel that adductor in there shaking just because I'm kind of pushing it to its limit there. Again, just focus on your breathing. We've got about five more seconds. Then we're gonna lay down and we're gonna do some hamstring work. Okay, so I'm gonna use a towel. You can also use a band. So we're gonna lay down, extend one foot out, wrap that towel around that foot, okay? And we're going to use the towel as leverage to help pull against that hamstring. All right. Now, I'm going to do this for a minute instead of just 30 seconds, okay? So, you want a slight bend in the knee. Just go as far as your body will let you. If it's here, it's there. If it's there, it's there. That's where I can use the towel to help pull it up. So, after about 30 seconds, what I'm going to do is I'm going to push that foot down. And I'm going to kind of fight against that towel just a little bit. And then I'm going to relax 
Then I'm going to try to go farther into the stretch. Okay? Again, keep breathing. Okay, that's a minute, so let's switch sides. Okay, towel, other legs out. And pull. But more than likely, you can probably feel one leg is either not as flexible as the other. That's in most cases, simply because we're usually one side favored, okay? All right, that's 30 seconds, so push, I'm gonna fight against that towel, I'm engaging my muscles, and hold for about five seconds and then relax, and we're gonna pull deeper into the stretch. Almost there. We're gonna finish with some spinal rolls, okay? So let that leg come down, roll up, hold on to your legs and roll. Okay, we're just decompressing your spine a little bit. Good job, there is a good cool down. Uh, if you have any questions, you can always message us at the bottom or send it to rush at clubhousefitness.com. Uh, we're here to take care of you.